Can you explain uh, your your actions tonight? Again, we were in the same situation we were before. Do you think the people who paid a thousand dollars for their tickets got their money's worth tonight from what you did? What do you think? He says, well, unfortunately, um, not every fight turns out the way that uh, everyone would like. I came here well trained, um, but as Damien disrespected me, uh, not as a, not as a, a person, but he disrespected me as a fighter, and I take that very seriously. And uh, I came here to do my job, and that was to beat him up and punish him, and that's exactly what I did. Unfortunately, it didn't turn out, and everyone wasn't pleased. But that's what I came here to do was punish him. Basically, he said, um, you know, I'm not too sure where what school Damien came from, but this is kind of a, a um, I sent a message because I think he disrespected me morally by the things that he said, and um, you know, and this is just a message that if anybody disrespects me morally, because I'm a black belt, and, and I've never stepped into the ring and disrespected anyone verbally before the fight and said things that he said. So, I, like I said, my focus was to go in there and beat him up and punish him. And unfortunately, some people didn't like the fight, um, and some people did. But um, it wasn't the way that some, most people liked it. So. For those that don't know, what did David Myers say that you believe was disrespectful? Então, olha só, é, começa por algumas, é, é, algumas picuinhas, e como por exemplo, eu nunca faltei com nenhum adversário desde que eu entrei aqui. A minha primeira luta aqui foi contra o Chris Lemos. Since, since the minute that I've stepped in the octagon, and since the minute I, the minute I started fighting and training martial arts, I've never disrespected any of my opponents. From my first fight here when I fought Chris Levin, I never disrespected him. Some of the things that he said, he said the thing about the eight legs, that I'm going to take one of the arms with me as Spider. And then he also said uh, uh, that if it falls on the ground, I'm going to take his arm and take his neck. And, you know, people have the right to say what he has to say, but it was just a lot deeper than that. And, and I just thought that morally, you know, I, I felt disrespected. Anderson, uh, or Ed, I guess the, the thing that I don't understand is if you're saying you were angry at him and you're fighting him, why wouldn't you throw punches at him instead of circling around and, you know, banging the canvas? If you're mad at him and you think he disrespected you, why don't you fight him and throw punches and kicks at him? I did what I had to do. I'm not here to be giving an excuse for anything or asking an excuse for anything. I did what I had to do. My job was done. My mission was done. My mission was done. You know, the way I feel is my mission was completed. I came in and um, dominated the fight and um, did what I had to do. 